Well, maple syrup is sweet. It's delicious. <laughs> it makes anything better. You know, we have this resource. Well, that's one thing that Letcher County has is trees. You know, this doesn't take the tree down, so it's not there anymore. Cheryl and Seth Long are producing maple syrup at their South Down Farm in Letcher County. It is a rugged terrain in the mountains of eastern Kentucky, and what some would term as not worth much, Seth sees it differently. Look around, people will say, that's hillside property, it's worthless, there's nothing here, you know, $500 an acre. But there's maple trees all over these hills, and we can tap into an untapped resource. The Longs built this sugar house thanks to a small farmer's grant from Kentucky State University, where they cook the sap collected from the maple trees on their farm. It's one of the reasons we're so excited about the possibilities for maple syrup in this area, because we've got the mountains, we've got the trees, and it creates a natural vacuum. So you don't have as much initial startup cost as you might if you had to get a vacuum system and all that. Using plastic tubing after tapping the trees, gravity takes over, forcing the sap downhill to a collection tank. It takes work to cook it down and, and to get everything set up, but there's a lot of people that are interested in the product. You know, you don't have to worry about trying to sell this product. <laughs> if you make it and you make it well, people want it. The Longs produced 38 gallons of maple syrup last year, and with 400 taps on trees this year, they hope to produce that much or more again. The Longs will be participating in the Kentucky Maple Syrup Day on February 1st, as will the Letcher County Extension Office, with its maple syrup demonstration and a pancake breakfast with, of course, maple syrup. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food, and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.